situation. There have yeah. been, Dan Aaron. There have been, as of 10 minutes before we went on air, 70 of them included in that swarm, the largest centered in Mono County. Thursday, a swarm of more than six dozen earthquakes, triggering rock slides and shifting the ground beneath these campers. I look down and the, literally the ground is just shaking. I've never seen where the ground is actually moving like salt and pepper shaker. At this small flea market east of the Stanislaus National Forest, mugs and antiques scattered across the floor. Never it just been popped. It's so hard. It just felt like it lift the building up and was slamming it back down. The series of shakes triggered by a 6.0 magnitude strike in Mono County. The rumbles reportedly felt as far as Watsonville, according to some social media users. Reports of shaking that we've had at large distances in San Francisco, in Las Vegas, um, are what we would expect for this event. Geologists with the USGS say the earthquake was on the Antelope Valley Fault, which is very active, but this was the largest on the fault since 1994. It was a, a, a fairly large earthquake. At the state's Office of Emergency Services, the shifting plates prompted shifting plans. We felt the earthquake and immediately pivoted and started, uh, you know, we put on the earthquake hat. Uh, fortunately, no one was hurt. The USGS says more earthquakes are a possibility in the aftermath of the event, but there's just a 6% chance any of those aftershocks will top the initial shake. The particularly unlikely scenario, take uh, this event, especially if it, uh, whether it shook you hard or not, take it as a reminder to get yourself prepared for future earthquakes. And how's about this for an early warning? Dan Aaron, the USGS said their shake alert system activated in Sacramento 23 seconds before the shaking started. All right. All right. Very good. Thank you, Christopher. Thanks, Christopher.